drum roll. I think this last one. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Amen. <laughs> Praise God. In Proverbs 11, verse 2, please read, uh, read with me. Pride leads to disgrace, but with humility comes with, with wisdom. Amen. Pride is the most deadly evil of all sin because it's the root of all other sin. Did you agree with me? Amen. Pride was probably Satan's original sin when he said, I will make myself like the Most High in Isaiah 14 verse 14. Pride was the Satan weapon used to tempt Eve when he set aside what <clears throat> God had said and assured her that if she eat the forbidden food, she will be like God. In Genesis 3, 1, 6, mm -hmm. whenever I sin, I am arrogantly, arrogantly asserting that I know better than God. Mm -hmm. As a Christian, we must constantly battle pride and grow in humility. Mm -hmm. And if you think you've been attained any measure of humility, You've got to be on guard against right. being proud of your humility. Yes. If anyone easily could have fallen into the trap of pride, it will be Ben John the Baptist. Mm -hmm. the, uh, why? During his time, growing popularity and to have followers, you can find that one in Matthew 3.3, 3. as John performing the baptism and Jesus came to the Jordan of River to baptize, John, uh, Jesus, I, John protested saying, it is I who should be baptized by you. In a fleshly, it's feeling there were aim and painless. You had the authority, mm -hmm. you are talk of the town, mm -hmm. that an awesome ever knows you have this kind of ministry. It should be a, a John Field during his time. And that moment he can take the opportunity not to do what the father asked him to do and claim and enjoy the worldly reward. But his desire, it's not in this world. His heart and obedience is to follow Jesus. When he says in John 3.30, he must increase, but I must decrease. In other translation says, he must become greater and greater, and I must be blessed. Mm -hmm. When one of the Jewish leaders asked him in John 1.27, who are you? Why are you baptizing? doing these things and practicing these things. Who sent you? Are you the Messiah? John replied, I am not worthy to be his slave and untie his trap of his sandal. The respect, the love is intact. Those words are inspiring, showing and speaking humility and knew it's not him, the one who sent him. My conclusion is, is it hard to deny ourselves, right? Yes. Our fight, our, we are fighting to our battles, but remember that our home is not here. Right. Each one of us has a duty to do and purpose must be fulfilled. We must guard ourselves not to fall by our mission. Putting away your pride and make ourselves ready to be a servant, that is your existence at this moment. We can hide, we cannot hide. God will reveal the real uh, you and me. Yes. Praise God. And everything was it, and everything it was put an end. All of us is accountable and we will be facing judgment. God is full of grace and we know that. He is full of mercy and he honors a repentant heart. In Revelation, he wore a white robe but dripped a blood of wrath of judgment. That I know everyone in this room does not want to experience an unbearable thing. Please don't be tired. Let's remind one another. Constantly prayer that everyone will go to the mansion of the of our Father prepared for us together. Amen. Amen. Wow. Yes, that was uh, very, very good. I loved how you started out 
talking about pride with the 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 uh, the subject was humility, humility, but you talked about the opposite for quite a while. Mm-hmm. That was awesome. Mm-hmm. Uh, you t- I said, don't be prideful of your humility. That was a great line. That was awesome. Awesome. And at the end, when the spirit is about to move, you collected yourself, and you can go either way. I mean, I don't know what you I didn't know. You collected yourself, and you kept going. Or you stopped yourself to hold the spirit back. That I don't know what happened. I don't know. So just know that if crying is okay, keep going. And if you think you're gonna lose it, <laughs> then collect yourself. But if God is trying to move through you, that's okay. Let Him use you. Okay. Yeah, just be mindful of that. But that was very good. Yeah. That was-